Good afternoon, children. Good afternoon, sir. Last class, lo, maths, lo, geometry basics. We have seen the basics of geometry in the last class. In that class, we have seen what is a line, what is a point, what is an angle, how many types of lines are there, all these things we have seen in the last class. Today, we will see the basics of geometry. 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 Recently, now we have to see some properties of lines. In the figure, there are two lines are there. AB is one line. CD is another line. These two lines are parallel lines. It means the distance between them is always equal. And another line which cuts these two lines. is another line that is called transversal line transversal lines so we say n n is a transversal line which cuts the parallel lines a b and c d then we get uh, eight angles eight angles four interior angles and four exterior angles angle a One here, angle two B, angle three C, angle four D are interior angles. Lock them. Angle five E, angle six F, angle seven G, and angle eight H are exterior angles. So it forms interior angles and exterior angles. In that. This one day angle Empty. is equal to three. One day is equal to three. And these two are interior angles. And those have special name alternative angles because one day and three are. On the opposite side of this transversal line, not on the same side. It is on the opposite. But these two angles, angle one here and angle three C, are the opposite sides of the line. This line. And so these two lines, angles are called alternative angles. Alternative angles. In the same way, two B and four, two B and four D are also alternative angles. Here, alternative angles are equal. Alternative angles are equal. And this five B. And uh, this four D, five and four D are on the same side of this line. Yes, on the same side of this line. Yes. Yeah. So that's why these angles are corresponding. Corresponding. So like that, six C and three C are corresponding angles. Two B. And the seven G R corresponding angles. Five E, I think one E and eight E R corresponding angles. So five E and four D, six E and three C, one E and eight H. Okay, one E and eight H. Two B and seven G R corresponding angles. Corresponding angles are always equal. Alternative angles are always Equal. What are? Equal. Under two are so many sums. These are the four sums you get. And we can find out the very easily by knowing the other one. And suppose the x degree sum. If five x five is equal to x degree, then corresponding to this four is also x degree. And uh, this is x degree. Since it is x, this is since 5e is x, 
six of f is one eighty minus x. One eighty minus x. This is one eighty minus x. And if you add these two, if you add these two, five and six of we must get one eighty. So that if we add x and x cancel, we get an angle of because. The angle on the straight line is 180 degrees. Okay, understand? Yes, sir. Any doubt? So, this is the understand? Sir, sir, I want to get out of here. X X cancel with the last class. जीरो Okay, so these are the lines we get. Remove it. Remove it. Parallel. Ah. So this is about the transverse lines and the parallel. Understand? Yes, sir. So find the problems if they given. When we go further, you will see all these things. Next, I have to. Go for triangles. Triangles. So, if the three lines are intersecting each other, then we get a triangle. Already we have seen yesterday. In that, three sides. Three vertices. So triangle means it is having three sides, three vertices, and three angles between them. So there is a relation between the sides and an angle. Sides and an angle. What is that? Is that? The angle, the side opposite to the angle. Is in the ratio of their angles. Suppose this is 60 degrees angle, this is 60, and this is 60 degrees. So let us D angle D, the opposite line E, F. E, yeah. F. Angle E opposite to the side D. Yeah. And angle F is opposite to the side. Yeah. You can suppose angle inner triangle. Inner yeah. triangle. Here are the here are the triangle. In triangle D E yeah. The angle D and the opposite to the side. Is not D the same as D E? Yeah. The angle D is opposite to the side of E F. So the second angle D is opposite to E F. Yes, sir. Next, the sides are in the ratio of their opposite angles. So, 60, 60, 60. Sum of the angles is 180. Okay. And the ratio of angle D is to angle E is to angle F is equal to. 60 to 60 to 60. That is what 1 to 1 to 1. And all the sides are equal. So that's why it is called equilateral triangle. These are very important for solving the problems. Suppose if in an equilateral triangle, an angle, I do the angle we go. Each angle is 60 degrees and 90 degrees. 
అది రెమంబరెన్స్ లోకి రాకపోతే మీకు కొన్ని ప్రాబ్లమ్స్ సాల్వ్ చేయలేదు ఈయన ఈక్వల్ ట్రయాంగిల్ అనగానే ఆల్ ద త్రీ యాంగిల్స్ ఆర్ ఈక్వల్ ఆల్ ద త్రీ సైడ్స్ ఆర్ ఈక్వల్ అనేది మెమోరీలోకి రావాలి సో ఫస్ట్ యూ హ్యావ్ టు సెండ్ ఇన్ టు అవర్ మెమరీ ఫస్ట్ మీరు పంపితే ఇట్ విల్ కమ్ అవుట్ అదర్వైజ్ ఇట్ డజన్ ఓకే సో దిస్ ఈజ్ అన్ ఈక్వల్ ట్రయాంగిల్ సబ్ టూ సైడ్స్ ఆర్ ఈక్వల్ ఇన్ ఎనీ ట్రయాంగిల్ దట్ ఈస్ కాల్డ్ ఐసోస్ ట్రయాంగిల్ ఐసో ఐసో నేను కూడా నీకు లాగే సమానం అని ఐసోస్ ఐస్ దిస్ ఈస్ సిక్స్ సిక్స్ సెంటీమీటర్స్ దిస్ ఈస్ ఆల్సో సిక్స్ సెంటీమీటర్స్ అంటే సైడ్స్ పీ క్యూ అండ్ అంటే ఈ సైడ్ కి పీ క్యూ కి ఆపోజిట్ గా ఆర్ యాంగిల్ ఉంది పిఆర్ ఆపోజిట్ గా క్యూ సో దీస్ టూ యాంగిల్స్ ఆర్ అంటే హియర్ యాంగిల్ క్యూ ఆంగిల్స్ ఆర్ డిఫరెంట్ so that's why the sides are also different, different not equal the angles are equal sides are equal yes sir so this is 60 this is 70 this is 50 so this opposite ga unde side ac this opposite side ab this opposite side bc or in the ratio of the angles and that ఇందులో ఉచ్ సైడ్ ఈస్ ద గ్రేటర్ సైడ్ ఉచ్ సైడ్ ఈస్ ద గ్రేటర్ సైడ్ ఏంటంటే దిస్ యాంగిల్ ఈస్ గ్రేటర్ సో ద సైడ్ ఆపోజిట్ టు దిస్ యాంగిల్ ఈస్ ఏబి ఏబి ఈస్ ద గ్రేటర్ సైడ్ అంటే లెంగ్త్ ఆఫ్ ఏబి ఈస్ మోర్ దాన్ కంపేర్డ్ విత్ ద లెంగ్త్ ఆఫ్ బిసి అండ్ ఏసి ద సైడ్స్ ఆర్ ఎఫెక్ట్ ఓకే అంటే సైడ్స్ ఆర్ అకార్డింగ్ టు దే అండర్స్టాండ్ సో లైక్ దాట్ అండ్ అకార్డింగ్ టు యాంగిల్ దేర్ ఆర్ అనదర్ త్రీ టైప్స్ ఆఫ్ డ్రాయింగ్స్ ఆర్ దేర్ దట్ ఈస్ కాల్ అక్యూట్ యాంగిల్ డ్రాయింగిల్ అక్యూజ్ యాంగిల్ డ్రాయింగిల్ అండ్ రైట్ యాంగిల్ ఇఫ్ ఆల్ ద angles in a triangle or less than 90 then we say that is called acute angle triangle so scalar triangle is always acute if one of the angle is 90 of the three angles if one is 90 and the sum of the remaining two is 90 then it is a right angle triangle it is a right angle triangle understand and if any of any one of the angle is more than 90 then we say it is an absolute angle triangle understand side is 60 and other different ones yes three sides equal ga undala naaku cheppara kaasa as ind equal ga number 60 so 5 centimeters 5 centimeters 5 three sides equal so that's why their angles are 60 60 60 ek sath mein angle dekh raha kam diya and last show me different ho na so sides are also equal different that's why this is 7 cm this is 6 cm this is 5 cm actually is round the that 70 ఇక్కడ సెవెన్ సెంటీమీటర్స్ ఓకే కానీ త్రీ ఆర్ డిఫరెంట్ కదా 
Sixteen. Four four that sixteen. That is equal to twenty five. Therefore, AC is all square root of twenty five. And root of five into five. Five is equal to five six. So five part means six five six. Understand? Yes, sir. We can do other problem. Can we do? Okay. Change the problem. What is this, sir? Three. अब सर आलस में चप्पन में पास पास इन दिस प्रॉब्लम दिस साइड इज़ सेम दिस डायग्नल इज़ हाइपोटेसिस 25 व्हाट इज़ द अदर साइड एंड अगेन सो प्रॉब्लम प्रकार हम ए बी स्क्वायर प्लस बी सी स्क्वायर ये जी बोल रहे हैं ए सी स्क्वायर ओके ना इपर मेरी ए बी एंड तो सेम स्क्वायर इस चली जाओ एक्स एम नो एक्स स्क्वायर ओके दिस इज एक्स एम होंडे इधर एट ट्वेंटी फाइव स्क्वायर आसन है इपर एक्स वाई यू फाइंड आउट चेल मां इ प्लस सेम स्क्वायर आउट कर दे एक्स स्क्वायर इज इक्वल टू ट्वेंटी फाइव होल स्क्वायर माइनस साइड दिन में रंडरा का है जेच्चू, इजीएस्ट में तो जा रहा है ना ये स्क्वायर माइनस बी स्क्वायर इज़ बोले ए प्लस बी इनटू ए माइनस बी, अंडे 25 प्लस 7, 25 माइनस 7, 80, क्या चीज़ लिए था, 25 होल्स के अंदर 625 पार्ट है ना वो उसके सॉरी सेवन वो उसको है ना पार्ट है और इन जो जो सब्टैक्ट है इसे लगा सिक्स ट्वेंटी फाइव वाला उनसे पार्ट है ना बिज़नेस ये सिक्स आ सेवन अंदर ना फाइव सेवेंटी सिक्स आ ट्वेंटी फोर ट्वेंटी फोर जा पार्ट में ओके फाइव सेवेंट अंडर दिस कैन बी रिटन एस फाइव सेवेंटी सिक्स इज़ बोल्ड ट्वेंटी फोर इनटू ट्वेंटी फोर एक्स इज़ बोल्ड स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ इस स्क्वायर इज़ कैन से रूट आंसर हम कुछ नहीं इसे ले ले रहा थी इसे इसे एस पे ट्वेंटी फोर थर्टी टू इनटू एटी दिन स्क्वायर रूट लगाता है, ठीक है ना? अपनी दिन 16 इनटू 2, ये 16 इनटू 36, ये 4, 6, अंदाज़ 24, आराम से चलते हैं, अंडरस्टैंड? यस सर Any doubt? No, sir. Okay. Next one. Switch it.